Well, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Good morning and uh, welcome to your daily morning Bitcoin update. Um, so, yeah, in this video, what we'll do again, if you're new to this channel, basically what I do every time because I cover Bitcoin daily. There's a there's a full upload schedule in, in the Discord server down in the description. Um, but basically what I do is we take a look at, at the general crypto markets. We take a look at some news around Bitcoin and crypto. Very relevant in this video. Uh, and we take a look at the price, maybe most importantly, kind of seeing what the price is doing and what's most likely to happen next. Um, so let, let, let's first check out that volume. I think volume has kind of evened out a little bit. Yeah, kind of. It's, a, it's at around 7.4, 7.5% uh, of the market cap. If you don't know, that's a pretty average. Nothing to see there. Uh, the main thing, though, that is coming up, uh, which is tomorrow, tomorrow afternoon, at least for uh, in, in European times. It's probably uh, the morning in the US and afternoon in Asia and, and the Middle East. Um, we'll get inflation numbers from, from the United States, all right, only from the United States, but those make the market move a lot. A lot of capital in, in the crypto markets, obviously, from the, from the United States. Um, so that always makes, makes the market move a lot. Uh, basically, it goes up if the inflation is lower than expected and it goes down if it's higher than expected. Um, so that's what we're talking, uh, what we'll be talking about. First of all, what you can see is that we have taken that break retest since yesterday off of 19,250, dropped down a little bit lower. Uh, what I said yesterday is that I expected us to kind of start dropping down towards 18,500 um, before the, the inf inflation rate tomorrow. And then after the inflation rate will either go up or down. More about that a little bit later in this video. Um, but right now, I mean, I, I still have the same opinion. Even though the, um, the, the, the mom momentum right now is relatively bullish, as you can see. Um, I still think that there's there's way too much resistance. We still have that resistance at 19,250, but don't 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 forget about that. That's not the only resistance you have. Basically, small resistance levels uh, r ranging all the way up to 19,500. Um, so so we might get a little bit higher than what we did yesterday, but still I think we'll find resistance there and start dropping down towards 18,500. Um, now, there, there's definitely a possibility, it's a realistic possibility that we'll drop down all the way to 18,500, um, but it seems hard, right? Because we'd have to do that in like a day and, and four hours, five hours, six hours, something like that. Um, and and that's, it's, it's quite a big drop for such a small period of time. So we will probably be um, in the middle of our fall towards 18,500 tomorrow. Um, and then when the inflation rate actually happens, uh, what will basically happen, I think, is that if it's higher than expected again, oh, excuse me, that's not uh, that, that's not a line, that's a fib. Uh, then I think we'll we'll be dropping down all the way to to at least eighteen thousand, but I think it's very likely that we'll drop down all the way to seventeen thousand six hundred. Um, and I'll also I'll repeat this tomorrow morning. Don't worry about that based on the prices of then. Um, and and if the inflation rate is actually lower than expected, I think we can get a move all the way above. 20,000 again and then from there we'll see I'll, I'll do some live coverage on it I think um, but yeah so so many great things are possible but it, it really depends on that news and then after that news we can uh, analyze Bitcoin in a relatively normal way again but it's uh, for now it's it's really waiting for that um, so yeah as I said tomorrow morning I'll be back with another take uh, based on the price of, of that specific time point in that day on, on what's going to happen with the um, with the inflation rate uh, outcome. Uh, but for now, if you found this video valuable, consider subscribing. This is my analysis. Uh, I hope to see you all in my next videos and uh, have a great day. Bye.